Hello? Jerry? Are you there? Let me in. I need your help. Jerry! Do your thing. Hey, Jonathan, you getting anything over there? No. Well, you didn't even look. Martha can't monitor herself, you know. I don't need to look, Tim. It doesn't work. It never works. You can't get energy from plants. You're wasting your time. And you're not? There's a reason the Engineering Research Council rejected your grant application. Again. Flying motorcycles of the future. <laughs> of toys, Jonathan. Look, if we don't get serious, Pensy's going to steal our funding. Diane just faxed your design to Manitoba this morning. Yeah. Apparently Penske wasn't having much luck with her own theory, so now we gotta double up. What theory could be worse than ours? Oh, oh that's... That's a double-double, eh? Yeah, a beach towel. Well, that's a palm tree, yeah? No! That's Cuba. No! Beach towel. Wow. We should get to work then. Yeah. So let's not leave the chance. Okay? Martha and I have bills to pay. You have what? Toys to make? Fine. Just stop talking to that plant like it's a person. It's creeping me out. Really, she's in the room, right? A little respect? So disrespect. Uh, I... I could have another... I have a name, remember? Sherry. Mm -hmm. I could have another sherry. I mean, not another sherry, <laughs> like a margarita. Another margarita, your manliness? Yes, please. Okay. okay. So, uh, what you got there? It's a uh, mock up for my project. Hmm, rad. Hmm. Is it for work? No, work's got us doing some bogus plant thing that will never pan out. Same. Yeah. None of my work projects ever go anywhere. I just thought by now I'd have invented something that would really make a difference, you know? Change people's lives, but I'm a joke. I'm not a joke. Well, maybe you should uh, ditch those dipsticks and do your own thing, you know? You think? <laughs> Die, you just gotta, like, go for it. Yeah. Where would I get funding? I'm sure something will come along. Mr. Moron, my name is Svetlana Slutskaya. I have business proposition for you. You will drink with me now. This way, please. Okay.
So, uh, Svetlana. <laughs> da. <laughs> You're a gymnast? Figure skater? A ballet dancer? No. Well, what business are you in? I am a Soviet spy. Right. Right. I'm sorry, what? I am KGB. We know you are government scientists. We are wanting to buy a work. This work? Oh, well, uh... Not the plant thing. Why is everyone so stoked about the plant thing? This is a flying motorcycle. Oh, and it is very nice. But you are brilliant man who came up with the plant energy plans. And these plans, we are prepared to pay you very much. How much? One million dollar. One million dollar. That's a lot of money. <laughs> I could get a bike. I could get an engine. <laughs> vroom, vroom. <laughs> vroom, vroom. <laughs> I could get in big trouble. Not if you do not tell. You don't have to tell. You can be so hush-hush. I can be hush-hush. And then you can go vroom vroom. <laughs> See, bicycle. Oh, I love a big, strong bull man on the bicycle. I could be a strong bull man on a bicycle. Yes. Do we have deal? OK. Okay. You want me to get the plans now? Not here. Go to the park in exactly one hour. There is a bench by the washrooms. An agent will meet you. Do not be late. Mr. Moron. Uh, I thought that was the agent. That is my dog, Mr. Moron. Right. Do you have plans? Good. Leave them in the bench and walk away. You will find money in the trash can on opposite side. Ah! I don't have any money. You want some? What? Roger Rogers, CIA. We're interested in obtaining the plans to your plant device, Mr. Moran. We're prepared to make it worth your while. Oh, I'll be right back. Hello, Pratt and Whitney. I'd like to order some jet engines. Oh. 
I can call back tomorrow. Okay, doke. Okay, thanks. Okay, bye. <laughs> Jonathan, where the hell you been all day, Martha? I've been looking everywhere for you. You almost missed the meeting. I was at the dentist. <clears throat> Wait, what meeting? The hands big emergency meeting. Come on, let's go. All right, all right. Settle down, nerds. Let's get this over with. I have called you all here to make an announcement. Despite the totally unsurprising failures of Project Mesh Submarine, Project Floppy Airplanes, and Project Hoon Shoes, it turns out you're not completely useless because Project Tree Zap actually works. <laughs> I, know. <laughs> I know, I was shocked too. Jonathan Moran's team's been working on this for five months, but the day after I handed it off to Penske in Manitoba, she faxes me this. Now, as you can see, the original plans call for a leafy thing and some string. Anyways, the point is, they got energy from a sugar maple. However, Penske wanted me to tell you, uh, in the case of reverse application, that is a backwash of power into the source, the possibility of a chain reaction exists. I, whatever that means. The gist is that it could explode. And because crazy people like to weaponize exploding things, you will all be following protocol alpha from now on. Uh, is that the one where we have to get naked and run through the chemical shower on the roof? Because we haven't had to use protocol alpha in about 50 years, I will remind you, it does not involve a chemical wash. I don't want to see your pasty butts on my roof. Thank God. Wouldn't fancy getting naked in this weather. I'm balls. Alpha is the one where your work can't leave the building, so you'll all have to get actual social lives and stop bringing your stupid house plants home with you. But it's Mineral Water Wednesday for us. She gets mineral water. That is all. Anyway, man, <laughs> congratulations, your plan works. Oh, you okay? You worry about Martha. I can totally just stick her in my jacket like this. No one will even know. Tuck her in the jacket. Just like my face. Tuck her in the Mr. Moran. <laughs> We've got a problem. No kidding. Uh, here's someone in your office is selling secrets to the KGB. I need you to find out who it is. Why? What are you going to do to him? I mean them. The same thing we do to all the traitors. Lana, you can't be in here. This is the ladies. I assure you, Mr. Moron, this is the least of your problems. Really? A small feather creature tells me the CIA has obtained the plans from someone in your laboratory. A small feather creature? That's weird. We need you to find out who this person is. What if I, he, she doesn't know? We are KGB. We have ways of making people talk. Do not let us down, Miss Moron. We will be watching. Hello? Jerry? Are you there? Let me in. I need your help. Jerry! But 
But so am I! I seriously doubt that. Sherry? Oh no, not you two. What are you? Am I six? Chinese intelligence? Cobra Command? I'm with CSIS. Who? Come with me. You know what really helped me right now? A margarita. If you're good, maybe I'll let you have a Kool-Aid. You see, we set this whole thing up to fool the Americans and the Russians. The plan thing never worked, of course. The whole idea is absurd. You can't make a nuclear bomb out of a ficus, for God's sakes. I mean, only an idiot or a spy would believe that. So, we fed you the research, led their agents to you, and voila. my whole life for shits and giggles. How the hell am I gonna fix this? Well, that's easy. We kill you. Jeez, you wanna scream a little louder? I don't think they can hear you in Moscow. Uh, oh, oh. Like I was saying before you had your little disagreement with the table, we had to kill a Jonathan Morin. Here's your Kool-Aid. Drink up. Oh, yeah. Welcome to the world, Mr. Hiscock. Holden? My name's Holden Hiscock? Who fixed your IDs, frat boys? Yeah, sorry. We're still trying to beat the dumb out of them. You'll be pleased to know your friend Tim gave a very moving eulogy. Apparently Martha's gonna name her first seat after you. Anyways, one of our guys took a videotape. We'll give you the VHS after you leave for New Zealand. New Zealand? Yeah, well, you can't ever see Tim or the plant again, obviously. You're dead. Well, Martha, I can't complain. Or Tim, really. But why? What was the point of all this? Um, we need a distraction. From what? Well... Is that it? That's all of it. You're sure? Do I look like an idiot? I'm CIA. We know how to buy information, okay? This is everything. Now get to work. The president is riding my ass, and he wants Sir, this thing before LL Cool. Calls from Berlin. If this is not the time. Comrade. Comrade, we're not bothered with shielding. This is not going to work. What do you mean it doesn't work? Of course it will work. This plant it does nothing. My sources assure me it will work. Comrade Slutskaya, I implore you, please listen. The news from Berlin, it is very bad. Burn the hole! Like I said. No, can we talk about Berlin? This is not the time to talk about Berlin. Sir, I... Come on! You must have missed something. I did not miss anything. There is nothing to miss. Will you shut up and listen? Make it work or I'll slap you in prison and fight something. Well, good luck finding a magic fairy, because that's what it's gonna take! The Canadians made it work. Fuck Canada! Canada? It's not even a real country. The <laughs> Berliners are rioting! The Berlin Wall, it is falling. They are demolishing the wall? I've been trying to tell you! Well, this is all your fault! My fault? I'm not the one who can't follow direction. Don't put this on me, it's a fucking plant's fault! Shit. We are all headed for Gulag for sure. V? What do you mean V? V didn't do anything. This is bullshit! We don't even get proper lab! And why are we speaking English?
I guess it was all worth it then. Thanks to your valiant efforts, you're damn right. So, you think maybe we could get a margarita sometime? <laughs> no. No. Yeah. Cool. That's cool. Kiwi scientists invent the jet bike. Huh. Hey, you think maybe it's in metric? Oh. Roger! <laughs> <laughs> 